Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are here at the 2024 Portland International Auto Show and we're gonna be doing a quick walk around of all the cars that they have here. Please, if you are new to my channel, subscribe, like, and share this video. Over here in the Kia section, they have this new Kia EV9. Here you have the Kia Forte, which is a really nice small car. And they also have this other Kia EV9, which is a really great selling three row electric SUV right now in the United States and it is doing really well in terms of an electric SUV. Inside this EV9 you get this power second row seat so when you move this forward you get a massive three row space. On the rear you get this unique lift gate which is really nice and massive cargo space which I think is really nice. This one has automatic lift gate. We have this Kia Sportage, which is one of my favorite Kia. We had a Kia Sportage a long time ago with just a regular diesel engine, and it was one of the most reliable car we had that we had a long time ago. Here they have the Kia Soul, which is a very funky SUV, or I don't know what you call it, a wagon, but it's a really great, efficient, suv one thing though is that this soul has a lot of reliability problems so if you are thinking of buying one of these you need to be really yeah this is what the soul looks like you get a lot of cargo space for this small suv that is why a lot of people buy it but the reliability issue is what is really affecting this Kia Soul. The thing that helps this Kia Soul is the interior. For MPG, you get 27 miles to a gallon in the city, 33 miles to a gallon on the highway, and 30 miles to a gallon combined. This one is powered by a 2-liter 4-liter engine with a CVT transmission called the Intelligent Variable Automatic Transmission. 23,990. 23, Over here, they have one of the best-selling mid-size suv in the united states and that is this kia telluride this one is a mid-size three-row family suv which gets about 18 miles to a gallon in the city 24 miles to a gallon on the highway and 20 miles to a gallon combined this one is powered by a 3.8 liter top v6 engine that is naturally aspirated that engine is paired with an eight-speed automatic transmission and this produces about 291 horsepower and 262 pound feet off with torque. this kia tell you right you can easily tow up to 5000 pounds which makes it a very impressive mid-size suv and another place this really shines also is that you get a massive cargo space which have this in standing out in the interior you get this curved double 12.3 inch central display with apple carplay and android auto and in front of the driver also you get a 12.3 inch digital display gauge over cluster. here in the chevrolet section they have this Silverado 1500 and here they also 1500 zr2 which is the most off-road capable this one because it's also a gm it has the multi-functional tailgate which you can turn into like a step when you want to get into the bed of this truck so you can put it away like that and you have this really nice looking bed or tailgate and when you fold this down you have a massive bed that is covered with this sprayed in bed line. also they have this chevrolet colorado this one is the zr2 which is a very off-road capable mid-size truck that chevrolet currently this offers. one is in direct competition with the new toyota tacoma that they are releasing so this one is a really great looking truck on this zr2 you have this metal piece that is included to it which makes it to be very off-road capable and you also get this LED light bar on this top. one. You get this really strange step that you can use in getting into the ZR2. In front of the driver, you get this massive screen, which look really nice. 
you get this soft leather seat which feels really over cool. here we have the nissan section we have the nissan central over there the new nissan rogue and here we have the new nissan frontier and over here to the chevrolet side we also have this Chevrolet. Trax, which is the most affordable Chevrolet that they currently offer. This one as it is currently cost about 25000 That is because this is powered by 1.2 liter turbocharged three-cylinder engine that is paired with a six-speed automatic transmission. The other thing that is really nice about this is that you get a very big leg room and headroom in this Chevrolet Trax, which I think chevrolet have done a really great job in designing this small suv here they have the chevrolet trailblazer this one is powered by a 1.3 liter turbocharged engine that is paired with a nine speed automatic transmission in the interior you get this double screen which look really nice for a cheap suv this like one this. as it is cost about twenty nine thousand eight hundred $85, which I think is a lot for a small SUV that is powered by a 1.3 liter turbocharged and you get this cloth seat with this RS, which I think is not bad for 23,000 SUV. Here they also have the 2024 Nissan Pathfinder. This one is the Rock Creek Forward. They also have this 2024 Nissan Armada, which is becoming a dinosaur because they have not refreshed the design this one has a v8 that gets about 13 miles to a gallon in the city 18 miles to a gallon combined and about 15 miles to a gallon 15 miles to a gallon combined the 18 miles is in the city as you can see from the interior this looks really old and this is what the rear of this armada is like this one is the platinum which is the highest trim level here they have this new honda prologue which is all electric and you get this led light bar and the led headlights this one is the elite trim level but this also have the e all-wheel drive which is a really great all-wheel drive system this one is a five passenger electric suv with a lot of cargo space one thing i think though is that this is priced too high and i don't think it's going to do well just like every other electric car that is on the market today in the interior you get this massive screen and in front of the driver you also get another screen so what do you think about this honda prologue please leave your comment in the comment section if you are new to my channel subscribe like they have share. the toyota corolla cross and over here they have the Toyota RAV, RAV4 plug-in hybrid and here they, you have the hybrid Toyota RAV4 and this army green Toyota RAV4 TRD off-road which is the most off-road capable Toyota RAV4 this TRD off-road is powered by a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine that is paired an eight speed automatic transmission this one produces 203 Horsepower. This hybrid is also powered by a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine. This one has a CVT transmission and this produces about 209 horsepower. This one is the XSE, which is the highest trim level. And this blue color is really This beautiful. is what the interior of this RAV4 is like. It's really nice and comfortable. In the Buick section, they have this all new M Vista, which is a really beautiful. SUV. this one has the coupe design but one thing that is amazing is that this one is very efficient and nice this one is powered by a 1.2 liter turbocharged engine that is paired with a six-speed automatic transmission this gets about 28 miles to a gallon in the city and up to 32 miles to a gallon on the highway on the front of this and vista you get this yuri this really unique design and here you get the led light and led headlights down here and this led daytime running here they have this 2024 gmc sierra 1500 1500 with a 6.2 liter 
Ecotec V8 and this one is the 84 which is the most off-road capable GMC 1500 Sierra